welcome everyone so today we are going to solve a question which is quite tricky okay this is a kind of question which can be asked in your cat or gmat or let's say ip mat all of these entrances can have these kind of questions okay so let's understand how do you begin solving this kind of a question okay so now one very important thing to always remember is that whenever you have these kind of questions you should quickly start noting down the kind of details they have given us okay so they have said the ratio of the present ages of reema and her son is 7 is to 3 so r upon s is given as what 7 upon 3 then they're saying a years ago the sum of their ages added up to 48 means r minus a plus s minus a is equals to 48 now we have told while the ratio of their ages then okay so that means r minus a upon s minus a equals to 3 upon 1 so i can write it as 3 so from here i can say r minus a is equals to 3 times s minus a so i'll put this value over here so i will have 3 s minus a plus s minus a equals to 48 so this looks like 4 s minus a equals to 48 therefore i can say value of s minus a is coming out to be 12 and i'll put the value of 12 over here so from here i can say r minus a gets you the value as nothing but 3 into 12 that gets you 30 6 okay so now add them or uh, rather no let's subtract them so what happens in this case is you will have s minus r and this a and minus a minus a gets cancelled because you are subtracting so your it will come plus a and this is minus so this is looking like 12 minus 36 gets you minus 24 okay so now let's put the value of r as from here i can say that r is nothing but what 7 upon 3 times s so let's put it over here in this equation so i have s minus 7 upon 3 times s equals to minus 24 so taking the lcm you have minus 4 upon 4 s upon 3 equals to minus 24 therefore this and this will cancel and you will have value of s coming out to be 18 now if s is coming out to be 18 so you will put this value over here and put it in this so you will get the value of r as nothing but what 42 but your question is not ending over here please understand they are telling you to find the ratio after two a years so from here let's put this value over here of r and you will find the value of a so from here i'll say a is coming out to be 6 okay so now basically what you have to do in this case is we will put the value or we'll try to find the value of r 2a a years ahead so r plus 2a that gets you what what is r r is 42 so 42 plus 2 times a that is 12 that gets you how much uh, 54 okay and s plus 2a that means what that is 18 plus 12 so answer is coming out to be 30 and we need to find their ratio so r plus 2a years upon s plus 2a years this is your required ratio we have 54 upon 30 and you can reduce it because both of them go in 6 tables. So, this is 9 za and 30. Sorry, not 30. It is 5 za. Okay. So, your answer is coming out to be 9 upon 5. I hope this is very, very clear to everyone. That's it for today. I will see you in the next video.